Good evening. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to Wholesome Memes. If you've been watching YouTube during 2019 and 2020, you would have seen that so many YouTubers have just been going mad on their subreddit videos, and it's become such a huge part of the community. I remember back in the day, everyone used to take the mic out of Reddit, and it was just that website in the in the corner in the back of the classroom on his own. So I'm here today on r slash wholesome memes internet for the spirit. So I just want to hope that I can make you feel a bit more positive, even just for five minutes of your day, that would be amazing. The wheelbarrow story, 6,000 upvotes. Okay, it's been, it's been removed. Just in case no one has told you today, good morning, you're awesome, have a great day, and nice butt. That's a nice meme, I like that. That is, oh, that's really nice. My seventh birthday party be like, ah, oh, you're all so cute. Everyone gathered together for a picture with the birthday boy. <laughs> what kind of seventh birthday party only had three people? Oh, I love that guy on the right. He's just, he's just so happy to be there. He's got the biggest smile on his face. And you can tell he's a dickhead that's just eating all the cake. Make people happy. Picture of my local bus driver before and after telling him thank you. Yes. Say thank you, but also wash your hands if you're taking the bus. The bus is still running. I'm assuming they are. Yeah, buses still run, don't they? Me, who accidentally said the swear word near a teacher. My teacher who was a lad. I'll ignore that. That was such a, a gut-wrenching feeling, wasn't it? <laughs> when you were to have a conversation and it slipped out and you realise they're right there and your stomach sinks. Mate, it's like, uh oh, 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 oh god, my life's over. I'm gonna fail English, I'm gonna fail everything, my life's over, completely over, just because I said flip. Oh, dude, and then he's, you he don't care. R slash wholesome vandalism. I do not condone vandalism. <laughs> You're someone's reason to masturbate. Oh my god! If you're having a if you're ever having a rough day, yeah, maybe don't think about that. I feel like I could make people either motivated or really uncomfortable and grossed out. But it's funny. You are perfectly imperfect. Happy birthday, schizo. Happy birthday, zombie from schizo. I miss you, schizo from. Oh, oh, that's so cute. They use the same pens as well. So that's not too bad because it's, what is that? Is that, on, is that on a bench? Like a picnic table? My mother has sewn over 700 masks by herself in the last one and a half weeks. Wow, that's like almost a hundred a day. And working weekends. Jeez. Like one every six minutes for 10 hours. That is mental. What a mad sewer. Overnight someone snuck onto our property and vandalized her car to show thanks. <laughs> oh my God, that's so perfect. I mean, they shouldn't have done that, they should have stayed inside, but still, that's such a great use of your time in quarantine. That's awesome. Why do people draw so many swastikas in toilets? Why is that a thing? It's such a weird thing to graffiti. It used to be numbers everywhere, and it's just slowly trickled down into racial slurs, and I don't get it. But this amazing soul has turned it into like a... a fairy. Oh, and the fairy's wearing high heels too. Ah, oh, it's magical. What is it, a mermaid? The bait is catching fire. The polls are not open. Public notice. I know all the words to Crazy Frog. Did I put this down? Was this me? Yeah, I think this might have been me, you know. I know all the words to Crazy Frog. <laughs> ding, ding. A message on the Clyde Walkway in Glasgow, Scotland. Was this Draconic? Draconic, are you doing graffiti, mate? Somebody loves you. That's true, there's gotta be someone. Yeah, there's always gonna be someone that loves you. So, even if you're struggling in your hard situation, because I have seen a lot of people struggling in quarantine right now. Remember that even if you live on your own, there's still someone out there that's thinking of you and that loves you and can't wait to see you as soon as this is all over. And if you know someone that's on their own and you haven't spoken to them in a while, just give them a text or a message. Just make sure that they're all all right. Spread positivity. And let's use this situation, which is so horrible right now in the world, to bring our community together, be more wholesome and positive as a species, and let's make 
this horrible event one of the best things that's ever happened to us socially. A kind word from St. Paul Bridge. Have a good day. That's great. That's great. Unless you're going down it. Then you, you see it everything. But going up, have a good... That's really nice. That's really cool. Thank you. You have a good day too. <laughs> that's really good. That's really, really good. I like that. I can't wait to hug you. Think of all the people you can hug when this is all over. You know, don't go around hugging strangers, but so much hugging is going to be happening. It's going to be fantastic. I love hugs. Hugs are amazing. The artist fights neo-Nazi propaganda with food arts. Let's have a look. Swastika. Oh. There we are. Some cupcakes. There we go. Wow. Oh, we got some more. I'm also even... A strawberry. Lots of strawberries. Strawberries and cream. Is he going to do ice cream now? Toothpaste? Oh, it's salad! Big up salad! Oh, someone's gone over his strawberry- Oh, he spent so long on them. So he's just made an even bigger watermelon. <laughs> awesome! And now someone's just done a swastika on his watermelon. What's he going to do now? You got it, mate? He's got anti-swastika paint. Hey! Bigger! Oh, I love that. Who is that? Originally from Sponge Guru. That's awesome. I mean, I hope it's legal. Even if it's not legal, then it's completely... You know, I agree with his message of putting it over. What I can see, though, is people doing the swastikas in the night. He's doing this all in the day. I can see police telling him off for it, which is... Which is just horrible to think that he's just trying to make some nice fruit and cakes. And there's people doing swastikas and he's just trying to help. <laughs> This could be flashbacks to one of the first Thanos videos I watched back in 2012, 13, when Modern Warfare 3 was huge. Must have been 2012. And they were looking at the big construction sign with the shovel in the dirt. And they made a joke about it looking like a heavy umbrella. That stuck with me for almost 10 years. And now we got this one. Caution attention. One out of every three snakes is an asshole. <laughs> and now I'm never going to look at this sign the same. <laughs> Oh, that makes me so happy. <laughs> there was some racist rubbish here, but I covered it up with a picture of a cat. That. Big up. Cats. Racism. Cats or racism. Cats are better than racism. Found this in a school toilet. Nice penis. I'm not sure if that's wholesome or just... What kind of school do you go to where the toilet seat's cut like that? That's such a sharp edge. That's health and safety. Like, what? <laughs> Who the fuck breaks a toilet seat? Someone was real hungry. <laughs> so, I hope that you enjoyed that and it's made your day just a little bit better. I'm not sure how this video is gonna, gonna turn out. But just remember that no matter what is going on right now, it's always gonna get better and you have the power to make it better today rather than making it better a month from now. So I hope you all stay super safe, obey the rules that are set wherever you're living right now, and enjoy the rest of your hopefully wholesome day, and stay hydrated. Bye,